Salutations and happy holidays. So Ring of Honor asked me to help pick a gift for all the ROH audience, and I thought, perfect! We'll give them some of my fresh cold pressed juices. I'm gonna need a truck full of peaches, some pears, some kumquats, a little bit of broccoli, and they're like, whoa, 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 whoa. We just need you to pick one of your matches so we can give it to them for free. And I thought, well, that's not much of a gift. Unless you show them the match where I won the Ring of Honor World Championship three years ago at the Hammerstein Ballroom in New York. And they said yes. What a treat. So, why don't you enjoy this holiday gift and stay limber, baby chickens. Befitting a rock star. And in the biggest night of his career, look who's here, Cook. The boys. The boys are back in town. Dalton Castle. Opportunity of a lifetime. I've never seen a man so focused, so determined. The glitz, the glamour, but when it gets down to brass tacks, Cole, this man is a wrestler and the number one contender. Will he etch his name in history here tonight? You saw the pictures, Dan. This guy's been wrestling since childhood. And yeah, he brings the pizzazz. But at the end of the day, the skills are there. But are there enough skills to defeat the Ring of Honor champion? We will answer that question here tonight. The Peacock spreads his wings. Boys of all shapes and sizes here in New York City. Wrestling has been one royal family. The champion had locked himself in seclusion, taking this match very seriously. The company that appears by Brandy Rhodes. The ring and hand that brand new Ring of Honor World Championship. 11 pounds of gold on the shoulder of Cody and Brandy Rose. Another kiss. Wait a minute. Look at that. Look at that. The world champion, he's made statements. He's taken the title around the world. He said he's a fighting champ like champions of the past. And now sporting that bleach blonde hair like so many before him has. Uh, including his father, Cole. I mean, this is on so many levels. A tribute, but also a realization of the now. And it is main event time, and there is only one man in professional wrestling who can introduce our competitors. We'll take it to Bobby Cruz. This is your final battle, main event. It's scheduled for one fall, and it is for the Ring of Honor World Championship. Introducing first to my right, the challenger. He is accompanied by the boys. Wrestling out of Catalina Island, weighing 218 pounds, Dalton Castle! His opponent to my left is accompanied by Brandy Rhodes. Wrestling out of Mariana, Georgia, weighing 220 pounds, 
He's representing Bullet Club, and he's the Ring of Honor World, World Champion. Champion. New talent. New talent. The American Nightmare, Cody. The American Nightmare, Cody, defeated Christopher Daniels back at Best in the World in June in Lowell, Massachusetts. We see the tail of the tape. Experience comparable. But you see, Cody, he has that legacy cult. He has it in his blood, in his DNA. Referee Todd Sinclair, we get a shot of that brand new Ring of Honor World Championship. And nice to see those two behind Dalton Castle up and down. Cody tried to ship him away. Dalton had been tracking the package, <laughs> tracking the package number. There it is, final battle. Main event 2017. History will happen tonight. Super exciting, Ian. Colt, we are trending top 10 across the country. We are trending globally, and we know, using the hashtag final battle, that this is the match everybody's been waiting for. Which story will be told tonight? Does Cody leave here? Capping off a 2017 of dominance. Oh, look for that low blow. He, he beat Jay Lethal last year here in final battle in his debut with that low blow. Yeah, Dalton Castle having none of it. Maybe telling Cody, it's my time, it's my turn. This is the story that will be told. Cody, the 23rd Ring of Honor World Champion. He's defeated names like Kushida, Sonata, Minoru Suzuki. Defeated Christopher Daniels, Rocky Romero. Extensive lists of defenses. Just last week, for Revolution Pro, defeated Jay Lethal, London, England. Yes, indeed, kicked in the midsection, drops down. Oh, look at this, so smart is Dalton Castle. Right into an arm bar, something we haven't seen out of Dalton, but it's not like he isn't familiar. And I wonder, Colt, apologize for cutting you off here, but Cody has made his opponents, his challengers, come to him in his title defenses. Beautiful disaster kick averted. Do you think Dalton Castle, part of his game plan, is to bring the match to Cody? Oh, it's, it's, it's super interesting. Dalton Castle, a very quirky, eccentric individual. It's really hard to tell what's going through his mind. If I'm him, I don't know. I, you know, I, I, I've spoken against it for so long, but I mean, those boys are finally here as they slide. I'd like to use them to my advantage. Dalton Castle now chasing Cody, the American Nightmare, around the ring. And he's coming after him. Yeah, and this is what I mean. You got to take the fight to the champion. We saw the rope and dope technique against guys like Kushida and Sonata. It worked with slightly less experienced competitors. But now the book is out. Uh oh. The book is out. Uh, Cody, ooh! He's flatliner from the ropes, hooks the leg, cover one. Cody sizing up the challenger. I think this may be a match, Colt, where the first man to make a mistake might be the one that comes up on the losing end, because you cannot make a mistake against either of these competitors. Yeah, but I feel some, both of them can come back from a mistake at any time. And this is the fight of both of their lives. This is the big one. Final battle. Ring of Honor's biggest show of the year. New York City. I don't think one mistake is going to take one of these guys out of the fight. But I got to ask you this, Colt. Ooh, that was a little low. Shout out to Uncle Bob. That. Yep, Alabama slam delivers. Hooks the leg. One, two. I don't know if he's got Uncle Bob's haircut. One. Gotta ask you this question, Colt. Go on. Cody has been in so many main events, so many pay-per-view main events, television main events. The lights have shined bright on Cody. Oh! <laughs> you don't mess with Todd Sinclair. Is that what you're asking? You asking, should you mess with Todd Sinclair? The answer is no. And Todd Sinclair is a big money referee. Here we go. Rolls up. Come on. Two. Look at that. Does he have it? Is that the lapel lock, Colt? Yes. Yes, it is. And look at Dalton trying to get to the ropes. Desperation, will there be a tap out? No, no, no. 
Cody now bringing Dalton to his feet. Yeah, I don't think you're gonna end it that quickly. Challenger to the outside. Inside out goes Cody. Ooh. I think that's what the fans expected. Those boys finally made it back to Dalton's corner. And you can tell, this is very important to Dalton. He needs them. Ooh! Getting closer to us here on the stairwell. Great shot of the champion there. Move! the cameraman out of the way here. That's something of mine. All of you. You know, this song. Might as well start getting in the ring, What are these barking orders? Timekeeper's table. I say the ring! Ooh. Delivers a forearm. These two men have taken it to the timekeeper's table. Aggressive shots by Dalton, too. Those. Now, Bobby Cruz, you better get out of there, buddy. Each one of those counting. Knee to the midsection. Look at this. Oh, he usually gets with a Rana. Not this time. Timekeeper's table right through. And I guess it happened in the middle of the action. Sinclair's OK with it. Let's take a look at that again. Time is up for that table. And is it up for Dalton Castle Cody? I'm not sure. Oh, come on. This is, this is not legal. This is not a New York Street fight. Is this his way out of this? Get himself disqualified. That can easily happen. Biggest event of the year. Wait a minute, the boys! They took the chair! They're not allowing that happen, and good for them. I don't know if we swayed, hold on. Brandy is climbing to the top rope! Brandy connects on the boys! And, and she could be women of the first women of honor champion. <laughs> Todd Sinclair calls the shots. Like, like Joe West in Major League Baseball, ejecting all three of them. And you want my analysis, Ian. I think advantage goes to Cody on that one. I mean, it's an ejection of Cody's wife and an ejection of two of the boys for Dalton Castle. And so to any, oh, come on. This narcissistic, you know, he's the world champion. He's brought Ring of Honor to the highest heights it's ever been called as world champion. Wasting time in the biggest match. Maybe, you know, maybe Cody has had the bright lights on him before, but this by far is the biggest match of Dalton Castle's career. And if you give him any opening, you're gonna regret it, Cody. Big right connect. And Castle delivering. And Cody staggering into the corner. Creating some space, but sent right back down with a big clothesline from Castle. The challenger now has the advantage, but a little bit of a limp there. Oh, that great catch wrestling is throwing the champion. Rear waist lock here from Castle. Cody trying to break the grip. Yeah, those grips are very tight. I've been there enough times with Dalton Castle. Charging in, misses. Here we go. Beautiful disaster caught. Beautiful. Pops those hips, gets down low. Release Northern Lights from Castle. Castle has to take advantage of the moment. He's got to feel the energy in this building. As soon as we say that, Cody's back in charge. Ooh! Spoke a little too soon there. Great offensive maneuver there by Dalton Castle. Yes, indeed. Pulling him right towards the... Ring post there. And again, that ring post does not move. It is very sturdy. Sinclair creating some space, allowing the champion to catch his breath on the outside. There's no winning that oh. battle. To the corner of my eye. Oh, and in, right, and in oh saying my that, goodness. you're not going to win that battle against that ring post. Wow. 
Cody split open. Now Dolph taking advantage of the moment, driving the champion into the barricade. With nowhere to go, Bobby Cruz, Nick Lendl, Kerry Silken. Trying to avoid the danger of this match. Castle now driving Cody into the mat. And look at that. He's not content with the cut yep. that occurred from the ring post. He's seeking blood. He sees it. He smells it. You see that opening, you go after it. That's what a champion would do. Let's see if Dalton Castle has it in his own blood. But if you're Castle, I mean, we know how stringent the New York State Athletic Commission is, Colt. You don't want to open that up too much. You want to be able to keep that sweet spot. Who oh, gets out of the way? Castle to the outside, and that's a huge miss. Dalton's still able to get up, though. Hasn't taken that much of effect. Springboard, and there it is. Beautiful disaster. That'll do it. Since the challenger to the outside. It's a great opportunity for Cody to get his bearings right now. Certainly is. Main event, final battle, the fastest sellout in final battle history. Sold out here. The Manhattan Center's Hammerstein Ballroom. See a great aerial shot now. Look at this. Look for the choke almost. Now the go behind. Bridging German. No give to that floor outside. And I can say with full confidence that Dalton Castle is now leaving nothing to chance. He's controlling his own destiny here in New York City. As about could be the bagger and Colt. Could be the bagger and no. no. Slips through. Too much momentum. Oh no, crossroads, crossroads. Snapmare gets out of it. Now we got a fight here, jockeying for position. Nice standing switch. Oh no, oh. Tom Sinclair is down. Oh wait a minute. In control. This is the submission he beat Adam Page with. The Julie Newmar. Julie Newmar. Nowhere to go. Nowhere to uh, go. No. Uh, kind of this. Oh, oh no. no. Come on. Oh, and he's. Come on. And Todd Sinclair is. I hate for this to be the fate of Dalton Castle. Taps the champion in the middle of the ring. No Todd Sinclair. How it's Claire knocked out. And I don't know, maybe that's, you know, Cody knows that. That's his way to have Dalton Castle release. And we've seen Cody use every trick of the book before. Here we go, Bangarang. Is he going to get it? Spins out of it. Oh, no. Crossroads. And time's up. Time's oh, up. Oh, no. Come one, on. Two. One. Dalton has found a way. He's got to be the only person ever here at Ring of Honor to kick out of Crossroads. Yeah, I don't think anyone's kicked out of the Crossroads in Ring of Honor. And here we go, New York City. Coming alive, looking for the disaster kick. He gets it. And you got to wonder how much gas is in the tank, Colton. I don't know on either, guys. Is Cody sitting there with a... A crimson mask. Off the ropes. Oh, he caught him. He caught him. Oh, my God. Bagger right. Bagger right. Cover. One, two. Done. That kept the hunt. Take the body down. City is on their feet! And for everybody that has been just a little bit different, everybody that's been unique, who's been told no, who's been told they'd never make it, Dalton Castle has proved that wrong here tonight. I am stunned, Ring of Honor Ambassador Kerry Silken with the brand new championship. We'll take it to Bobby Cruz. The winner of the match, and new Ring of Honor World Champion, Dalton Castle. He's been called the Freddie Mercury of professional wrestling.
what tonight call he has shaped his identity the record book will forever show that on december 15th dalton castle became the ring of honor world champion at final battle call him whatever you want but make sure you call him the champ what a special moment for this man right here and those boys who have been by his side since day one here in Ring of Honor. What a moment we're seeing right now. What a 2017 cult. What a way to cap off the biggest year in Ring of Honor history. Give credit to the former champ. But well, give credit to the man who when the light shine the brightest. Delivered in the main event of Ring of Honor's biggest event. Dalton Castle cements his legacy here tonight as the confetti pours down. For Colt Cabana, Pete and Ring of Honor, we'd like to wish everybody a happy Hanukkah, happy holidays. Thank you for the greatest year in Ring of Honor history. And as we, we live in this moment, Colt, the crowd jubilant. I'd like to thank everybody for supporting Ring of Honor. For Colt Cabana, I'm Ian Riccoboni. Thank you for watching Final Battle. We'll see you in 2018.